it's very simple to set a very hair trigger that's not overly um, insecure. So I'll run this up here. Keep it tight with pressure on it. Stick this bone here <clears throat> behind this tree. And I've got just the tiniest little notch carved in the end of this bone. I'm gonna go from this tree to that notch. Now, what this will allow you to do, see it's pretty easy to set. And it's actually really hair trigger, but I haven't had it go off accidentally yet. But it's, um, now what you can do is you could tie a trip line to this, to this stick very easily, or bait this stick, whatever you want. But let me just show you how light the trigger is. It's just the tiniest touch. Woo! Let me move my uh, melon in the path of harm, in harm's way. So let me show you more closely. There you go. Just on there, tucked behind this tree, up to that tree. Again, you can hook it to a <clears throat> what I think would be most effective on this end would be a barbed metal spike. That way you stick an animal, no matter where you stick it, it's going to hold it in place. I think that'd be your most effective type of spike to use. Um, you also, ideally, if you want this to last a long time, are going to want to like fire harden this, this stick so it doesn't lose its springiness over time. But again, watch the what a hair trigger it is. Hey! Nice. There you go, all set. Hair trigger. Oh! Got it.